This video is an overview of the Lion Operating System course at iRock My Mac, which is 10 videos and 68 minutes of training. So how do you know if you have Lion and if you even need to watch these videos? You go up to the uh, Apple up here in the top left hand corner. You choose about this Mac. Go right here. If you have version 10.7 or higher, you are running Lion. If you have under 10.7, you are not running Lion. If you bought your Mac since about mid to late July of 2011, it very likely came pre-installed with the Lion operating system. If you are considering upgrading to Lion, this is great training to watch as well if you're trying to figure out if you want to pay the either $29 or $39 uh, to upgrade to Lion. So in this training course there are 10 videos. You will see six of them here on the front page. You can see the other four uh, by hitting page two right here at the bottom right. The first couple, uh, the first three videos actually are all new capabilities that are in Lion. Now gestures existed before Lion with a trackpad or a magic mouse but it's been greatly enhanced in Lion. Lots more things that you can do with gestures. The second video is Mission Control, which is a new capability but really replaces and enhances what was called Expose and Spaces in Snow Leopard. So if you are running Snow Leopard, this will give you a good idea of, a, of a, fe a new feature that replaces something that you might already be using. And I offer a training course on Expose and Spaces, uh, but a new capability called Mission Control. Launchpad is new. Uh, frankly, I'm not a big user of Launchpad. Uh, uh, I get around my Mac without it, but it uh, kind of simulates the way that you open applications on an iPhone or iPad. And then we get into the enhancements and changes to some of the core applications. So Mac Mail, uh, Finder, and iCal and Address Book, all of these really work the same, but there's added additions and enhancements, some slight UI changes, user interface changes, things like that. Then we go into the second page here, the last four videos. Uh, these last four videos cover, if we scroll down here, you'll see that there are new methods to save files and create versions in Lion. So Lion does uh, things pretty differently with regard to how you save. Uh, so you're going to want to watch that. AirDrop and FaceTime are two new capabilities with Lion. Uh, both of them a bit limited right now. They're new, so it's kind of a typical release one of uh, features. But uh, check that out if you're thinking about using those. Search tokens uh, adds to and cha slightly changes the way that you do searching in Lion versus Snow Leopard. And then last is just little kind of embedded changes, small changes and settings that you want to be aware of here and there throughout the Lion operating system if you're considering an upgrade or if you uh, have just upgraded and you want to know your way around. So that is the Lion operating system training at iRock My Mac. As always, please provide feedback. Let me know what you think of the course, and I hope you enjoy it.